Hello everyone, Akash here. If you are currently experiencing hair loss, you probably heard DHT cause balding. Yes, DHT play a major role when it comes to hair loss. I will go through in this video everything you need to know about DHT. Also, the food can decrease DHT level or increase DHT level in your body to help prevent hair loss. But keep in mind, DHT not some evil hormone that just waiting to attack your hair follicle and cause you lose your hair. DHT actually a very important hormone that responsible many important functions of our body it's an androgenic hormones which means it's an important hormone related to male characteristic it's also an important hormone for male sexual development both men and women produce dht but the level of dht tend to be higher in men than women dht is a byproduct of testosterone production so as higher the testosterone level in the body more dht will produce also, too much testosterone can be the problem. Also, not having enough testosterone can be even more problem. So basically, testosterone is an essential hormone that plays an important role in the maintaining of our overall health and well-being. But the problem is testosterone is often converted into other hormones like DHT. DHT in our body increase as we age. It significantly increase as man age. And this increase is the main cause, male parent baldness. But the diet also plays major role, production of DHT. If you include proper nutrition foods, because lower DHT in our body or higher level of DHT in our body will ultimately lead to male parent baldness. So if you're not sure which food is good for your hair, the good news is there are many foods out there can help lower or higher the amount of DHT in our body. So the food like red meat, dairy, eggs, wheat. Red meat is high in saturated fats. Also dairy product rich in calcium and eggs are high in cholesterol. Wheat is a high glycemic food which raise blood sugar and insulin level. These foods will increase your DHT level in your body because these foods contain high amount of the nutrition known as biotin which is essential for the production of dht so just like many common food increase your dht level in our body there are many common food will decrease dht level in our body like green tea spinach grape broccoli green tea also has been shown to have a significant effect on lowering dht level green tea also loaded with caffeine which has been shown maintaining healthy level of dht also spinach one of the most nutrition dense food on the earth spinach also helps reduce stress spinach also have high level of vitamin e and vitamin c which shown to help to inhabit the production of DHT in our body. Spinach also has iron, which is also very important nutrient for keeping our DHT level check. Grape also excellent when it comes to inhabit the production of DHT. Grape also have vitamin C and fiber. Both of these two things helps reduce DHT level in our body. Also broccoli has a high level of fiber, which helps keeps our body testosterone level in check, which is also helps to prevent the risk of heart disease. So now you know the foods you need to include in your daily diet to lower your DHT level or increase your DHT level depend on your situation. If you have any question, you could always ask me in the comment section down below. You will find many detailed video on my channel playlist, which can help you every step of the way, how to stop your hair fall and how to have healthy hair and much more. You could also talk to me today. Just go to my website akashbishwas.com. Take care.